Hello everyone, I'm Steven, your online English teacher. And in today's video, we will be doing a conversation titled Grocery Shopping. So it's about food. Now, this is a medium or intermediate level conversation. The first time that I read this, I'm going to be person A and person B, and I will read from the beginning all the way to the end. I just want you to listen and repeat the words that I say, okay? The second time that we do this, we will do the creative conversation. And for that conversation, I will be A and you will be B, okay? So let's go ahead and try this. This is grocery shopping. Grocery shopping. Hey James, I'm so glad that I can go to your party this weekend. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah, Stephen, I'm really excited you can make it. I heard a lot of people are planning on coming. That's great. But to make this party a hit, aren't you gonna have to buy a lot of food? That's right. Can you come with me now to the grocery store on Main Street and pick up some things? Sure thing, let's go. Okay, here we are. I have a budget of about $100. That should be enough. And what food or snacks are you hoping to get? For food, I plan on buying some ingredients for sandwiches and chips. Sounds great. Anything else? Yeah, I might also want to buy some fruit. What do you think? Do you think people would like that? Yeah, of course. Fruit is always good. And what about drinks? Well, for drinks, I was thinking of buying some tea, coffee, fruit juices, and some soda pop. Wow, those are awesome choices. Okay, so why don't you go and find the drinks and I'll go and find the food. Sounds good. See you in a second. We'll meet up here at the front counter when we've found everything. Okay, see ya. All right, I found the tea, coffee, juice, and soda pop. Great. And what else do you have in your hands? What's that? Oh, I thought you might also want some delicious chocolate milk. That's all. You are a genius. Let's go. All right, so that's the end of the completed conversation. Now let's move on to the creative conversation. This is where it gets fun. So I will be person A and you will be person B. Now I don't know your name, so I will call you friend and you call me Steven. Now after I read my part, I will have you say your part and fill in the blanks with the areas that don't have any words. You need to be creative and think of words and phrases to finish your part, okay? And because this is a video, I don't know when you start and when you stop, so I will give you about five seconds to do your part and then I will continue, okay? So let's try this. Grocery shopping. Hey friend, I'm so glad that I can go to your party this weekend. It's gonna be awesome. Great. But to make this party a hit, aren't you gonna have to buy a lot of food? Sure thing, let's go. That should be enough money. And what food or snacks are you hoping to get? Nice. Anything else? Of course, that's a great idea. And what about drinks? Wow, those are awesome choices. Sounds good. See you in a few minutes. Okay, see ya. 
All right, I found the drinks. Oh, I thought you might also want some chocolate ice cream. That's all. Okay, that's the conversation. Now for this one, uh, remember to have a good time. Please fill in the words, the different types of food and drinks that you enjoy. And right now, I want you to go and find someone. Go find a friend, a coworker, a family member, and practice this conversation. Now maybe the first time you can be person A, and the other person can be person B, and just do the conversation from beginning to end. And the second time, switch roles. Then you be B, and the other person is A, and then go all the way through it. That way you can practice both parts of this conversation and really get an idea about what this conversation is about. So that's it, go ahead and have fun, be creative, and practice this conversation. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. For more lessons, go to EnglishStreams.com. I'll see you there. Please subscribe and share this video if you found it helpful. Please remember to keep learning and using English every day. I will see you next time.